welcome to the SAM4 demo. SAM4 uh, consists of IoT sensor hardware, analytics and a dashboard, plus a condition monitoring service. In this demo we can show you the hardware part, as well as how the dashboard responds to cavitation. So to start with the hardware, we install current and voltage sensors that feed into a data acquisition device that essentially turns the analog signal into a digital one. Up to 10 data acquisition devices or motors are connected to a single gateway via an industrial switch. The gateway connects to the cloud using 4G, cabled internet or Wi-Fi. In the cloud or on our platform we an continually analyze the data and we will send you an alarm as soon as failures are detected. Our online dashboard has health, performance and energy consumption metrics or an API to connect to your existing CMMS or other maintenance system. So SAM4 detects mechanical and electrical failures of both your motor and your pump. A lot of questions that we get is around how is it possible to use electrical signals to detect physical failures in a pump that it can be 100 or more meters away from where you're actually measuring your electrical signals. And the process is fairly straightforward. When cav cavitation is introduced, and what starts to happen in the pump is it'll start to vibrate in a markedly different manner than when it's operating in a normal mode on the curve. In traditional solutions you pick up that vibration by installing a vibration sensor. However, that same vibration travels from the axle of the pump through the coupling to the axle of the motor. At the motor it will disturb the air gap that sits between the stator and the rotor. And when you disturb that air gap it will introduce wrinkles on your sine wave. By measuring those wrinkles and by analyzing them we can effectively detect cavitation using electrical waveform analysis. Let me show you how. I'm starting to introduce cavitation here and if you look at the cavitation score on our dashboard you'll see it's green and green means good. But now as you can hear cavitation is being introduced. And with a slight delay, we'll see the cavitation score rise. There you go. Alright, let's get rid of the cavitation and see what happens to the score. Again, there's a slight delay, nothing major. There you go.